a bit about how you came to do Exodus and, and what your, your first steps were? Yes, Exodus was uh, our second project. When I talk about our second project, I'm talking about uh, my colleague, Charles Bowden, writer who recently just passed away <coughs> on uh, August 30 last year. And we produced uh, our first book, a collective uh, group of photographers in Chuck, and the book's title is What is the Laboratory of Our Future? Now, at the time when we published the book, many people were saying that the book was not, was not uh, true to the true nature of the border of Juarez, mm -hmm. because it was portraying a very violent reality. <coughs> Unfortunately, years later, it was prophetic. The book became prophetic because Juarez became the most violent city on earth for three time, from, for, from, uh, for three years in a row. But uh, after we published the Juarez book, we started to hear about people flooding border towns in Sonora. And we started to exchange email, emails. At, until at some point, we both started going to places. And for, for many years, for several years, we covered uh, this immigration until we found a publisher and then Exodus was published. Why do you call it Exodus? Well, Everybody not, here talks about immigration. Well, it, it was not me. <laughs> we had this um, discussion, Chuck and me, because he proposed the University of Texas Press to to make a trilogy with them. Mm -hmm. And Exodus was part of that trilogy. And he ended doing that trilogy and with two other books with Michael Berman, a photographer, an American photographer. And when we were doing the project and talking about the title, I was thinking about an, another title. But when Chuck proposed this uh, trilogy, he was thinking about titles that were related like bi biblical words, like Exodus, mm -hmm. Trinity, and the other is Inferno. I respected his decision. But, uh, he said, if I agree, I said, okay. My, my idea for title was the New Americans. Because the book, in the book you see Mexicans, but it's not a book about Mexico, even if you see 99% of Mexicans or Central Americans in some case. But uh, my point of the book was to, to portray a um, big number of immigrants getting into the United States and watching, looking forward to the future.